Hi, I'm Matt from HockeyBlues.ca, and this is the Hoopa, I think that's how you say it, I've never actually been told, um, Hockey Stick. So this is a new company, and they're based out of China, and they're going to try to come into the Hockey Stick market. Um, this is a prototype, the one down there is also a prototype, you can kind of see the different graphics. Um, I know some other people have gotten some other graphics, we got this one around Christmas time, and it had, a, like, one of them was, like, Christmas colored. Regardless, I've been testing these sticks out for them and doing, uh, like, giving them feedback on it and how it is. The first stick I have here is a P28 curve, which I'm not a fan of. It's way too much of a curve. Um, so this one is, they finally got a P92 or P29 curve in. So I'm testing this out and giving them feedback on it. Um, as you can see, it's an 85 flex. Um, so this stick is ridiculously light. This is the lightest stick I've ever used. Um, it It's under 300 and 370 grams. It's under 370 grams per weight. Again, this is a prototype, but it is under that number. I can't say exactly what number it is. I've been asked not to. Um, but I'm really interested in using this one and trying it out. I've already taken some shots with it. Um, but I wanted to do this video before I actually used it for good because I wanted to show some kind of interesting things on it. So hopefully, so let me adjust the lights a little bit here. Hopefully we'll get a nice view of the carbon because it's really interesting on this stick. Um, normally sticks have carbon weaves on it. This one does not. So you can kind of see like the, it's it, it's kind of like not a weave, but you can see kind of different, um, it almost looks like layers or just like pieces throughout it. It's very visible right here. And again, I'm trying to get that out of, so you can actually see it. it's kind of really visible right there. So I'll go down lower on the stick on the blade because this is right. So you can cut, you can really see it right here. So that's it's like an a very interesting carbon fiber for me. What it looks like. Um, normally, again, they're all sticks are really like you can see the weaves exactly. This one is still carbon fiber, but as you can see, the material definitely looks different. Or I believe it's carbon fiber. Um, I looked up some stuff online. It seems to match what this is, but it doesn't follow a strict weave pattern. Um, so I'm interesting to see how this stick will last. My other one has lasted fine for durability and everything like that. But I want to see how this will play uh, compared to some other sticks. Like I said, it is the lightest stick I've ever used. Um, it does have some, you can see the, the kind of internal rib. Hopefully, I can see it in person. Hopefully it comes off on camera. You kind of see it right there going all the way through. I found this blade to be very active and very pingy, which I'm a fan of. Um, but yeah, so that's about it for this video. I just kind of wanted to show it off before I tape it up and take it out ready to play. Um, this will, there probably will be more information on these coming in the future from me. Uh, but for the time being, here's kind of a little tease. Now, it's no bower advantage. It might be very, very close to a bower advantage. We'll see how... I like guess shoots and we'll probably be doing a full review of these down the line once they actually come out. But anyways, thank you very much for watching. Just wanted to show this off, give people some, uh, just a little heads up and maybe some intrigue. Uh, and here's just the other one. This one was just painted so you couldn't really see anything on it. Um, but yeah, so that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, uh, leave them below. And remember, I hate to say this, remember to subscribe to me on YouTube, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, helps me get gear like this so I can do reviews on, talk about it, and everything like that. As well, if you ever buy something because of one of my videos, please reach out to your manufacturer, let them know. Uh, gets me on their radar so I can get demo gear and stuff like this so I, again, I can make more videos. So thank you very much for watching and take it easy.